to school, back to school, to prove to dad that I'm not a fool. I got my lunch packed up, my boots tied tight. I hope I don't get in a fight. Oh, back to school, back to school, back to school. Okay, you two, Jacob is first day back homeschool. Watch this. <laughs> Look at you two. You can start off slow and go faster and faster. You can get dizzy and throw up. You may run fast when you pass your friend playing tag I can and run slow fast. down when you get to base. Many things are in motion around us. Hey, but some day. things are standing still. How do we get them? What? In motion? What makes something move? I don't know why it's blurry. Think about a toy car or truck. Pretend it's sitting on the floor in front of you. How could you get it to move? I'm not control. You might use your hand or foot to push it away or pull it toward you. You might hit it with another object, for example, a ball. You could even blow on it. That's not gonna work. There are many ways to get things to move. Guys, this is gonna be boring. The push or pull but that this we first use day. to make things move is I'm called a force. Yeah. A force is needed to make anything mm -hmm. move. Let's look at things a person pushes and pulls in one morning. Mm. This man pushes an alarm clock to I know he's gonna see something smart. When he wakes up. Read out. He pulls the blankets off himself and uses his legs to push his body up. Yeah. That's what we ever do every day. He open a cabinet to get out his breakfast. Now why are you starting He pulls out a bowl and a spoon. And there's no milk. And he pulls the chair back to sit down. Yeah, you and should. pulls it back in under the table. His teeth push and pull the food. God, Jacob, this baby work. When he's done eating, he pulls up he's all in, the food items he's on in, the table. He's in um, kindergarten. Don't, and don't say anything about that. And he's six, but the doctor recommended. I mean, it was our choice, but the yeah, doctor recommended, you know, he pulls. should maybe... Yeah, we Wait another year. We should have went last year. Cause he's smart. <laughs> Cause you can tell he's making fun of this. Okay, you're using your bikes. Pushing and pulling the pedals. Yes, you know. So, yeah. But he's smart. He's gonna get rubbed over. Listen, honey. You can go faster by using more force. Pushing and pulling harder. Yeah, you know, he's just like, whatever. But, like I said, he's so he's not that, that he would stay at home for another year. I kind of regret it. Because it was up to us. Like I said, he thought that maybe it would have been a wise choice. Because of his age, which doesn't make sense. Because he just turned six in June. So that last year would have been perfect. So then he'd be in, in first right now. I don't know. I mean, YouTube, anybody has children that are watching this should know that he should have had started last year. Boy. But, you know, it, with the, I don't want to say it, the virus, um, I'm kind of glad he didn't go. I mean, yeah, they stopped going in March, but I don't know. I guess it, it was just a smart thing. But no, he doesn't have like friends, like to meet friends or anything. It's the whole point is learning and meeting, you know, friends at school. Hopefully next year. There's so many videos now with the longest video okay. I ever saw. See, I told you. Alright, YouTube, I just wanted to put this in my little memory.
And it's hilarious. Jacob, you're too smart. So tell him, subscribe, and this is dumb. Hit the subscribe button, make my channel bigger. This is stupid.